No, 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 no. I'm, I'm beautiful. Okay, well, I'm Bob Ross. <laughs> All right, so let's do the intro where we always do it. I guess just like right over here. Oh um, yeah, we always okay. do it here. Hey, yo, guys, it's real. Welcome back to another video. Okay, go. This server is used to be good. I mean, I do agree. Hypixel did used to be better. Bomber, oh, my favorite game. Boom. Oh, that's a big TNT. Ah! Ah! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm actually gonna die. Ah! Okay, David. I think that we talk about the elephant in the room. How big is the elephant? Uh, it, it's a big elephant, I would say. A few weeks ago, I fumbled the bag with Boba Girl. Okay, so basically what happened oh, is okay. that... We, we <laughs> 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 is that is, okay, so basically, we, we were getting smoothies, and then as she was handing back my debit card, um, I like... My, my hand kind of twitched, and I knocked it out of her hand. <laughs> Anyways, okay, guys, um, we got banned from Hypixel. <laughs> Okay, David, can you please explain what just happened? I have been banned. Uh, my pixel, this is my apology. Of, it was an extreme lapse of my judgment. Okay. I need to leak his IP. I, I'm really sorry. Yeah, now when looking back, you said in all caps, I will leak your IP. <laughs> David. For 30 days, too, you're not going to be in the next Hypixel video. Anyways, you know, these shurikens, dude, they're actually so good. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him with the shuriken! <laughs> how oh to my punish, how to appeal it. You're dead! Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Uh, okay. Hold up, hold up. I'm literally, I'm pinging, I'm ping pong. Uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know how it works. I don't really care that much as well. <laughs> you know, should I do the same thing? <laughs> I mean, it would be kind of funny. Well, let's see. Let's see. Let's, let's limit test. Wait, but this would be such good clickbait if for the next Hypixel video, I put, we got banned. <sighs> you gotta do it now. That the, would mean that bait. I you will leak you. <laughs> Oh no! Okay, let's see. Oh, I just said it in chat. Uh, I'm I'm banned. I'm banned. <laughs> so okay, David. He okay. Honestly, I feel like if you made an appeal, they would be like, you know, it was by accident. Okay, you're good. Just you can't be saying that in chat. With me though, I did it on purpose. There's no way that they would have accepted my appeal. <laughs> I'm gonna go fail. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna commit arson. Like okay, good news. Now. People on Mineplex cannot PvP. Wait, what happened? Oh. oh, I won. Yeah! Okay, so recently, I got accepted into, like, this kind of prestigious thing, I guess you could say. I don't really... Okay, well, anyways. Okay, so yes, that is nice and all. But the only thing I don't like about it is that it's been, like, taking away from my other accomplishments, I guess. Okay, like, for example, I got accepted into this thing, like... Okay, I got accepted into this thing, like, I don't know, let, let's say a month ago. One week after that, I got accepted into the next higher-up, um, orchestra class. I go with my mom to one of her friends, okay, so her friend, it was the son's, um, like, birthday party. He was, like, five, whatever. So, anyways, so, you know, my mom's friends were there and stuff. So, a bunch of them are saying, like, hey, congrats, congrats, that, you know, takes a lot of hard work. And I'm like, oh, thank you, thank you. And then they're like, yeah, the prestigious thing is very hard to get into. I'm like, oh, you're talking about that. That 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 happened weeks ago. <laughs> like, what about oh. the thing that I most recently did? And also, the thing about this prestigious thing is that, like, no offense, but I didn't really need to try for it. Like, it's not like it was something that I had to, like, train for or whatever. Unlike this orchestra thing, which I had to, you know, try very hard to get into. This, it was basically handed to me. They're like, hey, fill this thing out. And then I filled it out. And then they ended up accepting me off of that. They're like, yeah, you know, you, you seem like a good student. I'm like, thanks. See, okay, like, I appreciate being, like, congratulated on. But it's also, like, I want to be congratulated on stuff that I actually, you know had to try for like relating it to youtube i would rather someone congratulate me on how good the plinky video was than how good like the last high pixel video was and it's like yeah i mean like it was a good and funny video but also it was just us talking it's not like a thing that i had to plan for for weeks and record and edit for you know multiple hours on end okay so i'm allergic to nuts but when it comes to items that say may contain most of the time you are fine. But it's like Hershey's, for example. The likelihood of a big company like that having a contamination is very, very small. 
But if it's like some random knockoff chocolate bar from like, mm. I don't know, Trader Joe's, then there's a higher chance. So anyways, okay, so, you know, Easter Bunny came and he gave me some chocolate. I'm eating it and I'm like, hmm, you know, my mouth feels kind of funny. And then my kidneys started hurting and I'm like, huh. So then I looked it up and if your kidneys hurt, it's because you know, your kidneys get inflamed whenever you have an allergic reaction. So basically I spent Easter, like my body was, was dying. Like, like it wanted to kill itself. I was just in pain the whole day. My lungs hurt, my kidneys no. hurt, my back hurt, my head hurt. But yeah, so this is my announcement that I will be suing the Easter bunny. Stampy had fun mini games. Stampy? On his little, yeah. Oh, that's nice. I was thinking about Stampy while I was in the shower. Okay, YouTubers always talk about how you need to study <clears throat> YouTube's algorithm and stuff and see what's popular at the time. No. <laughs> that doesn't work if you're a small YouTuber. It simply just doesn't. It, okay, it could work a little bit, but what you really need to do is study your channel's algorithm. That's what that that's the algorithm that you need to study. Like me and David learned that my top videos, okay, like the thing that gets some views is either like popular games such as like Doki Doki Literature Club or um, Left 4 Dead. I already died. One having a sort of like mysterious title. Like for example, the last Hypixel video was my highest viewed video and it was called um, like this is where we get canceled or something. Like that's like a mysterious title. It's like, okay, well what happens in this video that like, you know, this is where they get canceled, you know? And also the third one is the thumbnail. It needs to be, you know, like a catchy thumbnail. Ah! My cart! Okay, sorry, sorry, My sorry. Cart. My cart! Okay, whoa, whoa. <laughs> ah! Go, go, go! God damn, I... Oh, I hate you. Oh, I will leak your IP. Okay, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> try it, try it, try it. No! Oh, we're doing dropper. Oh, I got this. Oh, dropper. Now, let's talk about the Planky video. The, the scene I like the most was the one where it's like the heads, um... The, the heads on the pike. That is definitely my favorite scene too. Be okay. Well, originally it was just gonna be the flashbacks with like you know the actual soldiers. But then I thought, what if I also do it for Planky? And I feel like that's what like really ties it all together. Like showing like, hey, this was Planky like 50, 40 years ago, and now look at him. You know, like now he's covered in blood. He's in Vietnam. Like, how did he get in this like situation? Okay, so basically, I send it to my English teacher and my uh, U.S. history teacher. Why are people breaking these parts? I'm confused. Okay, so it was funny. So I sent it to them the the night that it came out. So then mm -hmm. the next day when I'm in school. Okay, so I'm looking at my um, English teacher's um, tabs because, you know, his screen was up on like the front board. Okay, so it's just normal stuff. It's like, okay, Schoology, uh, Google Slides, Planky. Wait a second. That's my video. <laughs> his favorite scene was actually the Hitler and Stalin scene because I, like he just found them kind of funny okay but also he had a few questions which i will answer right now i i already obviously told him the answers but you know for for the viewer's sake let me explain okay well first of all his reply to the email was well planky certainly did and then in quotes try very hard to die fitzgerald 66 i i assume it's from gatsby okay honestly i don't really like understand the context of that quote but it's fine, I guess. I kind of understand the quote, though, because, okay, obviously, Planky didn't literally, like, try to kill himself, but he kept on going war after war, and, like, it's kind of a shock that, honestly, he isn't dead. Um, okay, so his first question was, who killed Hitler? Okay, so basically, it was a Jewish man. Actually, in the script, I called him the last Jew. So basically, yeah, so Planky sees the Jewish man, and he kills Hitler, and then Planky's like, I don't really care about tracking you down because obviously they'd probably want to track down the man who killed Hitler. They're like, you know, I don't really care. We'll just say it was a suicide. I want to go home. You want to go home. We're done. And then he just leaves it at that. Three, what happens next? Well, obviously, as you guys saw in the, um, what I call it? In the reunion, uh, No Man Beyond, Planky and Mrs. Planky do find each other again. But obviously, there is a big gap between 1974 and then 2023 when they meet each other again almost 
what like 40 50 years later almost 50 years later you know I'll, I'll talk about this when i when i talk about um my history teachers okay editing ruby here because i actually never explained what i was going to explain okay so of course you know my history teacher also absolutely loved it in his reply to my email he was saying when the sequel comes out to also send it to him now okay obviously i was going to make a quote-unquote sequel at some point because like i just said there is a huge 50 year gap but originally, I wasn't going to post that video until a year or probably more, to be honest. But don't quote me on this, but hopefully by maybe this fall, there will be a movie coming out on this channel and it will be the continuation of what happened after, you know, the Planky video when it ends in 1974. His favorite scene was actually the training scene at the beginning. Yeah, and I feel like a training scene definitely can be like its own big part see but like i didn't want to make it a big thing because it's like we already know the outcome of this training like planky becomes like a menace you know like like we already mm. know that so yeah. i feel like it's not that important to see how he got there it's like okay that like he was trained by alistair that that's how now i'm confused by this game i i'm throwing tnt You're just and killing them with fireball. why am i out of hunger there's no way. Me too. But it was funny though, because, okay, he's talking about how, is this guy hacking? That guy's hacking. Yeah. Oh, that's the guy who beat me a ton. I was wondering why he was so good. <laughs> yeah, because like... he's hacking. <laughs> so now onto the big part of the, David, what do we do in this game? This is going to be the last video up until June. So I will be taking the whole uh, month of May off for, okay, well, a few reasons, a few reasons. Okay, I've done two huge videos uh, this past month. I did the Planky video, obviously, but also episode 100. Episode 100 took a very long time. So one, I just kind of want a break. Two, growing is definitely a part of of it like you know i'm not growing at a crazy rate i okay the last high pixel video i i i grew a fair amount i would say i mean mm -hmm. it's my highest viewed video now so i'm i mean i i am proud of that but also like i don't want to be spending all of my time on videos that like people won't see and appreciate you know okay and honestly the final reason which this is why i oh, i'm dead but this is why i even started kind of thinking about taking a break is because honestly people have been really really annoying me and frustrating me while recording okay like in the past it's always been tiny things like hey this person is swearing a bunch and i need to keep on reminding them that that's a tiny thing and you know that person doesn't do it anymore but like i have had some of the worst like incidents while recording that i've ever had before for example someone fell asleep while recording a video with me that is the rudest thing anyone has ever done to me while while recording like how do you fall asleep while recording a video like come on you know one of, one of my friends wanted to record okay they kind of inspired um like us doing this one video so i'm like you know that's a great idea let let's do that you know so okay i'm like hey can you do this for the for the video i told them this like you know earlier in in the week because i'm like okay i, I want to record it on wednesday so can you do this uh not on, on wednesday on the weekend so can you please I, I told them on a wednesday that's why i said that so i'm like hey mm. can you please you know do this like before the weekend so that we can record it's it's a tiny it's a small thing in my opinion okay so the weekend comes and i'm like hey so when do you want to record that and then they're like Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, I, I actually didn't have time to do that thing yet. <gasps> I have the hacker yeah. on my team. Let's go. Now, okay, this person is talking about how, you know, they're extremely busy. They're an AP student. Um, they have school, yeah. work. Now, okay, I, I understand people do have, bu do have busy lives. But you also got to understand every single thing you just mentioned, I also have the same thing. I, I also go to school. I'm also an AP student, which also, frankly, that means little to nothing. And also, okay, so this person works, yeah, but also, I would bet that I spend more time recording, editing, and planning videos on a weekly basis than you do while working, you know, like your day job. But, okay, I'm not trying to hate on the sleeping person or the excuses person. See, but also, like, the thing with these incidents, though, is, like I said earlier, like, they are my friends. You know, we're gonna get past this, we're gonna, you know, keep on recording videos. But there was one person... And I've never asked this person to help with a scripted video before, but I asked them to help out with the Planky video. They were not listening. I would say, hey, can you stop doing that? They would stop. And then two seconds later, they would instantly do it again. I'm like, come on, really? 
so that person you know that was that was their first impression of that that was my first impression of like recording a scripted video with them and i'm like okay if you're gonna do that then 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 it doesn't work out so that person i'm not gonna ask to you know help in a scripted video again see but also recently i feel like people could maybe say that i've become ruder but i think truthfully i just haven't been taking people's um I don't, I don't know the nice word for it i've been taking people's junk you know and excuses and stuff mm -hmm. i've just been like no you you said that you were gonna help with this so help you know like i'm not taking people's bs so has that mean that i've become more stern and rude i guess sure okay the nomad frankly i would say that it's better than most smps out there just for the sole reason that most smps either they end because okay well okay there's three things that that could happen either one they get so invested into the storyline to the point where they can't just play the game normally <clears throat> dream smp or two the server just becomes an anarchy server i can't think of any examples right now but yeah so that's why we have a bunch of rules on the nomad so that it doesn't turn into that um and then the third one is that people just get bored actually no i can't think about an anarchy server no craig server that that it both turned into an anarchy server because they he did, did not yeah because he didn't enforce the rules and then the third thing is that people just get bored and then quit which that is what happens to most smps the game partially could be like because of it like for example um koala left because he simply just doesn't play minecraft anymore and that's fine but also i feel like you definitely need to do stuff to keep people like interested in the server for example we tried doing nomad game nights and we tried doing um server-wide events like you know the wedding was one of them that wasn't like a planned thing that i did this is more of a question yeah who is the best recording partner besides me because mm -hmm. i'm the best yeah frankly i i mean i would say that, that you would have to be the best probably anthony i would say anthony yeah it, honestly it okay in the past i do have to admit and and he even knows this and, like he's owned up to it that he has you know wasted time or kind of sweared a bunch so then it's like hey like it like i gotta keep on reminding him but no he has honestly mm. frankly gotten better because he he wants to help out you know i, I, thought you would I would probably lazo. say him or it depends on lazo like okay he's not available that's the that's like the biggest thing i think that's the thing not... see but like he he can be good it really depends like for the planky video he was really on that that's why i thought lazo would be would have been your pick but i, I could see anthony he's yeah because he's available most of the time exactly He's always energetic. He's always willing to do the thing. Yeah. And yeah, no problems. Yeah. See, I haven't broken him like I've broken you yet. So, so like he's still in like that wait, good, like, like ripe age. What? No, I'm no, no, wait, no, not, not eight. No, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> wait a second. Uh, wait a second. Uh, I will leak your IP. <laughs> I don't care anymore. <laughs> ban me. Ban, ban me, Mindplex. Do it. What do you say is the best SMP server? Um, I would have to say Hermitcraft. See, but also they do like seasons. Even people have like said to me in the past that we should like restart the Nomad. I'm like, no, that that's not that's not our type of server. But for like a server like Hermitcraft, it definitely does work. And I mean, they're all just a big community, and that's why I would say that. If you have a storyline, it's kind of difficult to. Th then it keeps you kind of um, like attached to that world. Cause like I mean, if we reset the world, then every memory of Robert and Robin and all the people that have you know quote unquote died on the nomad they're they're gone off camera who annoys you the most who like out of like people we record with i would say maybe lexi <laughs> yeah mm. yeah i'm sorry i'm sorry lexi yeah maybe Wait, her so this is is this off ca off camera or on camera oh, oh no it's on camera yeah no yeah 100 oh. percent. I'm, I'm not oh, fake would you mind explaining why oh yeah of course at the very end when planky kind of yells at that one rich dude i told yeah. her to you know run away after because you know planky kind of squares up with him and then he's like yeah. you know just leave before i go to prison and i'm like okay run and then i'm like and okay now switch into the uh, gemini skin and then i kind of go into like position and then like she's like you never told me to to stop running and i'm like ah, it's kind of obvious like <laughs> like don't you think i said that we, that we stopped the scene <laughs> So yeah. you're talking about before how you become more stern, more angry. Yeah. But I noticed this. I think like one of the better directors or like movie directors are usually the ones who are more angry, more stern. I don't know if it correlates, but it seems it seems to. So it's be that good way, right? that I'm an. Asshole. I mean, I mean, it, it's well, good. Not exactly. Not it. Like you always, you still want to be nice to them, right? Well, yeah. But sometimes you, you do have to be a little bit mean. This is for you guys. Right. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post. Turn on post notifications. Uh, a thousand likes and he'll come back tomorrow and oh yeah follow him at 
creeper underscore ruby. Don't follow me because I'm sus among us. And yep. yeah, that's pretty much it. Yep. Peace. Peace.